A terminal server or a remote desktop services server is a multi-user environment. Therefore, software has to contain different settings for different users. Whenever you go to install software, you need to take this into account and let the server know that you plan on installing software that should be available for all users. So before you do any updates to software or install anything, you should open an administrative prompt by going down to start, right click, go to administrator command prompt. Once this administrative command prompt is open, you want to do change user slash install. You will then get the session is ready to install applications. Run your setup, do whatever you need to do. If you do have to reboot, um, this can sometimes cause some problems if the install wants to start back up again immediately. Um, you will probably need assistance for that, but hopefully not. If it just needs to reboot, well then you're fine. Um, if it needs to reboot and then do more things, you'll need to put it back into install mode before the software continues to install. So that could be tricky. But, however, if it's just a normal install or an update that doesn't need a reboot and you're done, you go ahead, once you're finished with that, you can either just log out or you can do change user slash execute. And now you're back in the execution mode to where this individual user has his own settings. That is install mode. Hopefully that will help you out for any updates or installations that you need to do on terminal services with a remote desktop.